Wow. What an awesome find. This is Lily uh, with the Florida Native Plant Society, and I'm out here in Calhoun County today because we got a tip from a member that Saracenia leucophylla was growing out on a roadside out here. And so I came out to take a look, and I found some. I've counted over 70 plants today, and there are probably a lot more than that uh, because they're just coming back from dormancy, and they're a lot harder to notice, except when they're blooming like this. And these are the blooms. This is, again, Saracenia leucophylla. This is called the white top pitcher plant. And they're called pitcher plants because they have these modified leaves in the shape of a pitcher, and they're carnivorous. They actually trap insects down in this pitcher. They trick them into heading down there, and then they can't get back out. And they are digested in digestive fluids inside the pitcher, and the plant absorbs the nutrients from those insects and that's how they have figured out how to live in nutrient poor soils so it's a really cool adaptation these plants are um, they're native to the southeast but they're really uncommon in florida so it's really important that we preserve and protect all of the um, existing uh, populations that we have left and so we are really appreciative of members who tip us off about plants like this so we can protect these populations. Um, it's very important if you're taking photos or video or sharing online of, of um, rare plants and carnivorous plants in particular to not include the location data in your photos or when you post to include a location or even information about the area that is too specific because these plants, carnivorous plants in particular, and rare plants in general are poached by um, collectors too often and people will drive from all over the country down here just to dig up these plants so keep that in mind and um, enjoy wandering in the wild